Hello, this is Happy Feet Rika. How are you doing, everybody? Today, I'm going to do high intensity interval training for plus size people. Number one, modification series. There is、uh, there was a request to modify each movement, so therefore I'm going to show some modification for each movement. Also, I want to emphasize when you to do high intensity interval training, how much you will be in, intensively is really each individual is different. So, how much you fast, how much you big movement, it's really up to you. Safetyness is most important. So, please do your pace and mindful. Okay, then let's do it. I'm going to put weight. This weight is each weight is you know, five pounds.、Um, the past I lost my weight, such a much. So I put him back again, and I try to feel you know the how was I am. So it's a kind of fun things. And also let's do start from the warming up. Okay. So first we are going to do warming up. So warming up, just shake your body, good, and go to the shoulder, two, three, and come back, one, two, three, good, and next side to side, side to side. Let's do each three times. Very good. And we will go to warm circle as much as you feel comfortable. Three and back. Two, three, and go to the rotation. Two, and knee slightly bent. Two, one, two, good. Then side bend. So. We can do side bend and reach your arm, but if it's hard, reach your arm, reach up. So you can do just the body side, reach, or just right. So each one more time. Good. And lift your leg. Two, 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 two. Good. And heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel, toe. Good. And then one. And we can do stretching. Okay, so now first movement is a side squat. So side squat is basically go to the side step and squat and come back center. Side, actually side squat together, side squat together. So that's a basic movement, but it's a quite you know the hard you know the, it uses really strong muscle around the knee. If you have a knee problem or a little bit hard this movement. You always can make a little side step and just a little bend. So that's a modification. A small step and bend. Small step and bend. And also, speed is you don't need to go too fast. So your pace. Okay. Good. So that's a side squat. And the second one is a high knee. High knee is a basically for. The goal is after hip height. That's the goal. However, if it's kind of hard, really as much as you can bring up knee. So that's your goal. And also, how you know the fast you can do is really you know, up to you. Okay. Good job. So that's a high knee. 
So next movement is a punching. So punching. That's one also. When you can kind of get used to it, you can kind of go side bigger. But at first, maybe that's a movement. And the punching forward diagonal. Good. So when you do each movement, posture is very important. Not curl forward, not go to the you know the back side. Try to be centered. So that's very basic. So posture and your face. Okay? So that's the inner punching. And next one is um toe and center. And so this one is kind of lunge and center. Lunge and center. Lunge and center. Lunge. So try to you know the not to your knee beyond the toe. That's a kind of goal. And if it's kind of hard to go deeper, you always kind of touch the knee and center, touch the knee and center. Or really kind of rotate center, rotate center, rotate center. Goal is really kind of work on your core first. When you go to the waist shift, when you kind of waist shift, you can work out your big leg muscle. Okay? So that one is a toe or a lunge, center, toe, center, exercise. The next one is a hamstring curl. So hamstring curl is a very simple. So you can kind of do many kind of arm. Yes. Okay. And next one is again we will kind of go lunge. And if you can do little jump, lunge, little jump, or and little jump. If jump is hard, always you can do just a reach and close down, or just even just a reach. Yes? And how in the past is really up to you. Good. So then next one is a skating. The feet together and then legs go back. Yes. And this one, so first you will go to, you know, if you know that you cannot get you so it's kind of hard always try to do you know the small step small step even arm is in the on your waist and then today first thing maybe you start from the bend your elbow and when you kind of get used to it and then extending more bigger yes good 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 so that's good then finally we are going to do jogging or no rope jump even jump but it, you know you don't need to totally jump if you want to you can but you know that if you're tired you can just go to the toe standing as well or it's very kind of in a fast walk always mindful that's the point okay but a little by little when you kind of push yourself at a comfortable way okay so are you ready Let's start it. First, side squat center. Side squat center. Do you remember? Modified. First, get used to the movement. If squat is hard, small step, just a tiny bend. Also, you can modify the speed. How much you can go fast. When you get used to it, you're ready. You can speed up. Go a little bit deeper. Yes, good job. Keep going. Oh, 10 seconds rest. Good. So next movement is high knee. Okay, so as much as you can, bring your knee. Good. Maybe first your goal is bring your knee up. Kind of hip high. That's a maybe first your goal. Then maybe next is keep up your speed. Nice job. Don't hold your breathing. Keep breathing. Good. And 10 seconds rest. Good job. So next one is our favorite punch movement. Get the kind of comfortable, stable base. Good. You can first do 
Hang in nice, long, neat. Nice job. Then when you can get used to it, maybe very it. Perfect. Yes. Nice job. Good. Yes. And last. Okay. Next one is we are going to lunge center. Lunge center. Lunge center. Okay, now when you go to lunge, if you cannot go so deep, you can touch the knee first. Yes. Beautiful. Even this one is hard, you can modify. It's most important thing is kind of use your oblique muscle, your core muscle. That's the kind of goal. So let's first heal it. Okay, so 10 second rest. Good. Now, hamstring curl is coming up. Good. Hamstring curl. Nice job. Beautiful. Yeah. Nice. Keep your pain. Even have a straight curl when you get used to it. Wide. And speed up. Beautiful. Nice workout. Good. Okay, so there's the can rest. So we are going to rotation again. This time. Good. And lunge and jump. 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 If it's kind of hard, what you do? Reach. That's right. Reach. Reach, reach, even just to reach your arm up, not most time. Yes, and rest. Go. Next one is skating. So skating is a side to side movement. So first maybe bend your elbow and small step to the side. Good. So get first movement kind of idea then when you get used to it maybe we can change your arm first the more intensive if you want to put the big step to the side or same with this but the kind of fast okay and you can rest good the so last movement is we are going to jogging Place. Good. So, how much fast is up to you? Or you can do no long jump long. You can you can jump, but also you can just uh, put the toe. Whoa, even it's work out. Quite good. So it's up to you. Jogging. Or no long jump long. Good. So now we are going to Go back to the at the beginning. Okay. Side squat. Okay. So now when you get idea, maybe you can do a little bit deeper, wider, faster. What do you think? Good. Anytime when you're tired, go back to your feet. Yes? Good. Most important things, safety. And also, start walking up. Good. Be breathe, everybody. Next is a high knee. Let's go. Go. Maybe. Keep high. How is that? Good. And go on. Good. Maybe a little bit faster. Yes. Go your face. Nice job. Good. Yes. Okay, 
best. Alright. The next one is my favorite. The punch movement. Nice face. I did and the hard one too, huh? So if when you go jump down, you the knee. So therefore, if you have a knee program, maybe you shouldn't jump. Good. The last one is we are going to choking or no rope jump rope. Good. No rope jump rope. Everybody, hang in there. Go to the side squat. Okay, this time, I will pick up my face. Yes. Go. Go. Nice. It's quite a
beautiful. Good. So now we are going to diagonal rotation movement. I skip one exercise. I think it was skip. So let's one more skating and then we are all done. Okay? So small step. Then when you get used to it, you can make a little bit lighter. If lighter is in the back, would be small step, but I can make So try to work on Which muscle you're using? That muscle really works. Wow. Yes! We got it! Awesome! Good job, everybody! Nice job! Stretch side. The other side. Center, squat, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, arms up, up, and slowly down, feel the spine, and right shoulder in, good, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, switch, woo, so feel good, four, three, Two, good. Okay, go to the center. 
and spine. Cat stretch up, down and down. Up, up, down, down, up, up, down. Okay, all the way. Roll up, feel the spine. Woo, and shoulder rotate. Beautiful. Shoulder small. And elbow. And big circle. And side to side. And big circle. And side to side. Good. Stretch neck and shoulder. Feel it. And go to the halfway rotation. And the other way, stretch. And halfway. Good. Deep breathing. Breathe out and cross. Hug, hug. One more. Breathe in. Breathe out. And the other. And top. And hug. Good job, everybody. How are you feeling? You did excellent job. I'm so proud of you. Remember, high intensity interval training. High intensity, it's for you. So you will keep your pace. You will decide you know, how you will go intensive and then you can kind of progress. Okay? And posture is very important and don't dehydrate. Okay? I'm so glad you work with me and please come back next time. Okay? See you soon. Bye!